My name is Brian Ceballos. I'm from Pasco, Washington. My life before Christ was a roller coaster of up and ups and downs, mostly downs. And, you know, my dad was a missionary, and when I was 11 years old, we moved to Mexico to start a, a mission in his hometown. We built it with our own hands, and by the time I was 13, it got to a point where we had to support our, each other and support ourselves with work. So I decided to move back to, to Washington and go to school and support them by that means. Um, ever since then, I went through a lot in my life. I started straying away from the path of righteousness and started going down a, a deep and dark path that was leading nowhere. But you know, ever, eventually, it got to a point where I was just in a bad place, you know, drugs, gangs, crimes, violence. My life got into a really, really bad place. And as time passed by, I kept on straying and straying away from, from the path of God. It went to a point where I had, this, I had my son, and I was just a horrible father. I was a horrible person to my family. And I knew that wasn't the place to be. I knew that wasn't the real, the real me until I got to a point. It was February 20, April 22nd. And I was just in a bad place, and I decided to call on God. And He was always there patient. He was always there waiting. After 12 years of just me doing my thing, He was still there. And when I called on Him, He reached down and He pulled me out of that deep and dark place that I was at. And ever since then, my life hasn't been the same. Ever since I rededicated my life, and Jesus saved me on April 22nd, 2016, my life has never been the same. I was searching for God and searching for, for, I was searching for God and searching for a place where I could feel like home. And until my friend, um, he invited me to Hungry Generation. When I was, in, I was invited by my friend Marvin to Hungry Generation. And ever since then, I looked around and I saw all, all the youth, saw everybody and the love that they had for God. And I knew that this was my home. I knew this was the place for me because I felt the same way. And now my calling is just to reach out for the youth, reach out for all those troubled youth that are lost and that need Jesus, that feel like there's no hope, and to reach out for them and tell them that there is hope. And the same God that helped me and changed my life can save their life and change them completely. And tonight I want to get baptized to show my commitment and to show everybody that I am I'm going to be born again and I'm going to start my new life and start a new life, a new path in the, the righteous way of Jesus Christ. All right, Brian, do you believe in God or do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and Savior? Oh, yeah. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes. Based on your faith, confession, and your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.